Anyway, hey y'all, how y'all doing? Yes, honey, we are on our way to get a motherfucking little change, darling. And I said, let me stop on by because I have the time to stop by and to. What the hell is going on here? What lane is this? Is this. Okay, no, no, this ain't my stop. Yes, girl. What the hell is going on here, y'all? What the hell is going on here? They got a farmer's thing going on. What is this? Oh, this is a racing car track, y'all. Ladies, all you single ladies, if you're looking for a race car driving type of man, stop on by here. Yes, they'll be here chasing Chase Chevrolet and uh, the race car's coming on, honey. I said single ladies, unless you're into a married man, because you know, some of these men are here without that. Is that your type right there? Yes, girl, big old bear man, honey. Y'all see back there in those vineyards back there? Y'all see those racing cars over there? Anyway, I guess I guess why it's still hot. Why it's still hot? I said let's go ahead and, and, and use this hot weather. Ain't nobody mad at you, girl. Ain't nobody mad. Anyway, so I want to stop by because of course I mentioned yesterday about the flash sale due to the donation that I received, and I did not put the link up there. I was so I had so much I had to do yesterday. I said, honey, I'm listen. I'm not overworking myself. I'm taking it slow. Okay. So yes, I finally posted it today. So we are ex we are extending it until tomorrow at 5 p.m. You check the blog spot 28 spirit 8 mystic 8blogspotcom It's also in the description box. Click current deals and you will see the um I think this is my turn. You will click current deals and you will see yes, yes, yes. You will click current deals. And you will see the flash cell link there, information on that, as well as you will see the uh, lighting service that I offer. Only some people took advantage of that. I don't think a lot of people know about that. Some people send me emails that be like, can you do this? Can you do that? Outside of casework, and I tell you guys, I do casework. Like, this is my work. There's no freebies, honey. There's no, uh, you know, I, I know that you're, you just sent something up for me. No, because I'm in casework. Now, if there was ever a time where I wasn't doing casework, possibly. But no. Girl, let's not disrespect. You wouldn't go into McDonald's and ask McDonald's for a free McDouble, would you? Or say, hey, McDonald's, can you throw in some extra sauce? Even though I say 25 cents of sauce, well, I come to you guys all the time. Can you give me a free sauce? I don't give a fuck about that. So anyway, so yes, I offer a lighting service that I've actually been offering since March of this year where you sent in, I think it was $25 and uh, I light a tea for you. So that is not casework. That is you're doing your own work and or you're like, listen, I need a prayer sent up for me. I light a light on your behalf. I light a light on your behalf. That's nothing but the devil neither. Every time I do a live video with you guys and I try to focus in on what I'm talking about with you guys, there's always some type of side distraction trying to call me. And it's like, I'm at that point where, girl, we're gonna have that 1-800 number when you call. And that's not a spiritual call, that's a personal call. But it's not the point. Bitch, I'm driving and I'm talking. Bitch, that's some work. I'm driving, talking, and bitch, when you're talking and you're driving, you gotta have your full attention on what you're doing. Oh, you died. So anyway, yes, we're gonna go do an oil change, honey. Yes, girl, I told y'all, I live out of the city. I live 20 to 30 minutes out of my motherfucking city. I keep telling y'all, honey. So give me that time to make my way on in. We're going to do an oil change. I got probably another five more minutes. And let's see, yeah, so with the counter lighting service, basically, you just want a little extra push. You're like, listen, I got a test tomorrow, I'm missing a final tomorrow, I need some energy. Come on, can you send some light out there for my spirits coming out? Yes, girl, send me a $20, and we light that candle. There is no insight, there is no work, there is no uh, reading on what is going on. It's just an energy boost. Uh, so yeah, that's also posted with the link, $20. And it's gonna be 20 up until Wednesday. I think after Wednesday, I'm gonna make it 33 because sometimes that stuff do turns into other things and I gotta be prepared, honey, to come out and be like, girl, za, za, ze, va, moi. Okay, anyway, so uh, yeah, so that's really what I wanna stop by and talk about is the f new moon flash sale. The, mo the new moon is tomorrow.
and uh, it will be until 5 p.m. Uh, this is for medium level, uh, deep level rituals. The consultation is waived. Um, I want to schedule the consultation. My upper lip is sweating right now, y'all. I sweat on my forehead and my upper lip. Yes, girl. That's all I sweat at, girl. I don't get sweat around my neck. Probably because I don't have a neck. I don't know. I, I, don't, I don't sweat underneath my armpits like that, neither. Sometimes my toes get sweaty. Depends on what I'm doing. Anyway. <laughs> But uh yeah, I'm gonna put my Billy Crow so they know why I'm turning. That's a cute little trucker there, huh, y'all? Yes, yes, girl. They got some coin, girl. Bitch, they got some coin, girl. They got a, 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 a SUV and they got a truck. Bitch, they got some motherfucking coin. And you better watch yourself, Chevy. Motherfuckers, they be trying to just jump in front of you. So, uh, yeah, so like I said, yes, medium level, deep level rituals, $100. That is a steal. Y'all know what I do. You know how I do. Read the details so you get your tea. Once you send in information, I'm requesting. And I put this too in the, in the little section. Please use your consultation for your concerns about the casework. And that's it. A lot of people do consultations, and we're talking about other shit that is not that important. They build a new house is right here, too, honey. You see that right there? Yes, they built a new homes right here. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. I wouldn't buy the house out here, girl. Bye. They got rats out here, girl. In the middle of the night, too, girl, you be seeing uh, coyotes and shit, mountain lions, honey. Like, for real, for real. Mountain lions, coyotes, and all that, girl. Crazy. And I think that was a dead something on the side of the road, girl. I didn't want to see it. My friend said it was a pit bull. I don't think it was a pit bull, girl. I grew up with pit bulls, bitch. We had five pit bulls. Uh, I know what pit bulls look like, girl. American pit bulls and non-American pit bulls, bitch. They're not that damn big. And that thing was big. It had a big body. It, girl, it, I would say it was along the lines of a Wendigo and a bear. Now, I know Wendigos, you know, that's the theory and all that good stuff, but it was along the lines of a Wendigo and, and a bear. Bitch, that body was huge. And I said, whoever hit that thing, their car got fucked up. And my friend said, how do you know? Bitch, you ever hit an armadillo? Bitch, you ever hit a deer? Girl, those little ass fragile deers will fuck up your car too. So you can't tell me that they hit that big ass thing, girl, and nothing happened to their vehicle. That thing was big, y'all. And she said, well, maybe it just died on the side of the road. Bitch, it was in the road. So the bear was like, or whatever it was, was like, <laughs> God damn! That bear said, <laughs> it was dying. No. <laughs> Fuck that. Bitch. I'm not laughing at the man dying. I'm laughing at that, that, that she gonna sit there and say that maybe it just died like that. So it just died in the middle of the in the middle of the thing, girl. It just said we're here at Walmart. Ooh, they kinda busy, y'all. I hope the wait ain't three hours. She coming to get me if it's three hour wait, y'all. I'm gonna wait in Walmart for the damn three hours. She coming to get me, bruh. Are they close? I don't know. Oh my God, y'all. How do I? Best, best Penzoid Platinum Full Synthetic. Penzoid better be good. And I don't give a fuck about that. Penzoid better be good. And I gotta walk my happy ass all the way around. I know that, I know you gonna like that. Are they gonna let me go? Hey, hey, girl, let me call my friend. It says right here, used oil. I told my friend they use used oil. She said, girl, well, they gotta put up there to use used oil. Bitch, no, the fuck they don't. Bitch, I don't gotta tell your jackrabbit ass a motherfucking thing, bitch. What you gonna do? Anyway, hold on, y'all. And I'm gonna look at y'all comments. I'm gonna look at y'all comments. We don't want coin flying everywhere. You know what I mean? You know, you know. You, you know what I mean, girl. Mm, I, I hope that I hope that you guys could uh see me in 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 in
somebody calling me? I think you better call Tyrone. Yes, honey. Yeah, honey, I gotta let them know that I've arrived, honey. How are you doing? Oh, girl, my thighs are sweating, y'all. Ooh, Jesus, my thighs are sweating, y'all. Y'all ever got sweaty thighs? Mm-hmm. And they're not that big, neither, girl. I guess my name is gonna be Juicy Thighs, girl. They're not that big. Mm -mm. Am I upside down? Oh, my God, I'm upside down. <clears throat> So it said uh, Pinzol Platinum Full Synthetic Motor Oil, Lube Oil and Filter. I don't get what that means. So they don't change your when they do oil change? Oh, they're about to get cussed out if they don't. Girl, ain't no cars getting worked on right now. What do you think they're doing? Hold on, y'all. Hopefully this door is open. Because the bitch just walked all the way around. It is. Okay, let's see what's up in here. Come on, tea guy. Come on, time to see Toddy. Girl, you gotta tell me your tea. What's going on with that business, Toddy? Hello. Hello. Yeah, uh huh, uh huh. Got it. Hey, guy. Yeah, I have a these salmons that I got from Amazon. They, they make me an inch and a half taller than what I am, so I'm six feet three feet. Hey, and uh, I'm lucky, you know what I mean? You know, I can be tall, 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 I because I know you're out there working hard to make your teas work. Well, let me tell you what made me do this. So someone sent me in a donation, Mina, and they said, I want you to do some free casework for some people. And I said, bitch, excuse me? Bitch, if you send it. I think you need to be an investor. That's what I said. I said, I think you need to be an investor, see? But, uh, so yeah, he said, okay, well, at least, you know, blah, 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 blah. So I said, okay, let me, let me put my own little twist on it. I was waiting for him to send me that email <laughs> to talk about things, but he didn't. Yes, honey. Cody's in my dorm. It's kind of <laughs> Jay, you're so crazy. <laughs> ah, it could have been a shapeshifter. And listen, don't do that to me, Jay. Jay, listen, don't do that because you're she shit over here, Jay. Don't do it. You know, we were talking about this. Me and my, uh, me and my sister, we were talking about this. My spiritual sister. Ooh, the door came up here in the shop, honey. Mm hmm. There's a shape shift in here, Jay. Something here. Working with the electronics of the door. Jay? Jay, you see that, Jay? It didn't start until I got up in here. Come on in, spirits. Follow me around. Come on, honey. They follow me everywhere. Come on in. Anybody try me, you get them together. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Anyway. <laughs> me and my sister, hello Lady K. We were talking about this. We were saying that people who watch that conspiracy stuff typically have more experiences of um, weird things happen to them and i believe this because there's a person i know that is a skeptic and they actually was, i won't say nothing because then people know who i'm talking about and a few people that know that's in my city they know they watch this so anyway so end up having this let's wait for him on it We gonna shop until we drop. If I gotta, if I gotta wait, we shop until I drop. Oh, well, I finish it. So basically, what he was saying was that he was watching this TV show, and when he was watching this TV show, something startled him from the show. And he said, while he was watching it, he was like, and he kept jumping. And he said, after that, things started to happen to him. And I told him 
that's exactly why you gotta be careful what you watch because you're giving energy, you're giving out pulses of energy every time you attach an emotion to a thought, right? This is why magic starts with your thought. So each time you were, you know, you were stirring up some energy and you drew energy in. So he had to go to a healer and uh, a person to, to go in and tap that energy out of him. And he felt better. But somebody said, see, that's why I don't watch that shit like that, honey. Anything that's going to stir up a weird response to me, I'm not watching. I guess I'm going to in. She look. Girl, hold on. Did I tell you I went to a store and I was waiting in line? Now, bitch, I had a yellow dress on. I looked like Big Bird. I was waiting in line. And I, I don't know if people just thought I was busy. Girl, it was like seven people that jumped in front of me. Bitch, do y'all know that I had to catch myself? I threw everything down. I left out that store. Because I said, my friend was like, you should have said, girl, I would have read everybody down, would have got kicked out that store. And that was a high-end store. It was Rayleigh's. How you done? Anyway, so back to that. Yeah, so you have to get a cleanse. It works. But I'm like, see, you gotta watch yourself. Light your tea, prepare yourself. Don't just light up and do this. Yeah. Hey. Hey, how are you? I'm good, good, good. So you pressed that hair, it looks good. Oh, girl, bye. Something new is stirring up, huh? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I'm next, uh-huh. Um, oil change? Okay. Uh, let me go, let me go see how many cards I can Okay, have. okay, go ahead. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. They always do that. That's why I hate coming there. What? I was here. There was nobody lying there. And he's next. You know I was standing right here the whole time. You see my big ass. So bad. Well, anyway, how are you? Good. Tired. Yeah? What time you start today? I didn't come until four today. So the question is what you do last night, man, out there. Nothing. They, <laughs> they had to schedule four to ten today. Mm -hmm. And now they were already outside talking to my manager yesterday. It's like, oh, time. Mm -hmm. So she brought me out to my full time. I said, oh, no. So, so it's kind of the, 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 they're cutting out. <clears throat> oh. Because they're saving up the holidays. That makes sense. Okay, so right now, um, I can write you up, but they're not going to start working at it until 5. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah. Because uh, one of the technicians is leaving. Okay. And only, there's only going to be one back there. Okay. They're going to be working out there. So okay. Okay. So I'll write you up, and then, um, that's fine. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I need that all oh, changed. That's right. Okay, okay. Yes. And then, all righty, bye. And how long will it take? After that, it's going to take about four times. Oh, that's not bad. Okay. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. I'm going my shopping. I didn't really want to today, but I'm going to have to end this and call her because they, girl, they said at 45 minutes and we're starting at 5 o'clock. It's 4.45 right now. 
So what's a good hour? That's not bad. A good hour before they'll be done? Well, like an hour and five minutes. Hmm. Maybe we'll go get something to eat, honey. Anyway. Come on. I love Jones. Long time no see. Yes, we're all technically shapeshifters. Well, in the energy class, Jay, I want to focus on uh, teaching you how to uh, be in multiple places at one time. We're going to talk about remote viewing. We're going to talk about putting yourself out like that. You know, it's believe it or not, I did something last year. I had like probably, whoo, everybody and mama hit me up. Hey, hey, I had a dream about you. Hey, hey, we did this. Hey, we did that. Bah, 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 bah. And everybody's dream was the exact same dream, right? And I told them it wasn't a dream. And everyone who had the dream, they experienced it differently. Like one person said that in the dream, well, maybe I won't put it out there because she'll be like, bitch, I didn't, I didn't tell you to put my story out there. No, I'll say it because she, she'll, she'll hit me up. So one of the dreams one of the girls had, I gave her a diamond, a book, and I gave her a key. And believe it or not, we were working on something for her to manifest. And of course, the diamond, the key, and the book all symbolizes something different. And she actually ended up getting a new job. She actually ended up getting promoted within that job within the first 30 days of working there. She got a new house and a new car. And she also got offered something. I won't put that here. She doesn't have to put it out there. So yeah, and she comes in this chat regularly too. So you can ask around if you want to. Oh God. But um, yeah, 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 yeah. I will talk about that. Thank you, thank you, Love Jones. How are you? Long time no see, honey. Yes, it is a good day, it's Saturn day. Happy Saturn day, honey. Feliz Saturn day. Come on, yes. We'll say Feliz Saturno, okay? Thank you, Joy. Anyway, y'all, I think y'all, I think I'm gonna go, cause I'm gonna call her. I need to go through my little goodies book bag here. You know, I got some books up here I need to go through right now and uh get me some oh my god they got some new sunscreen y'all let's see what it looks like <gasps> oh y'all it says vanilla cocoa girl it smells good y'all y'all need to wear some damn sunscreen some of y'all need to wear that sunscreen honey you're gonna be looking like donald duck Hi. Hello, hi, hi. yeah. <laughs> You're gonna be looking like Donald Duck before you even 50, girl. You better put that sunblock on. <laughs> ah! Anyway, it's going good. Yes, come on. Thank you, thank you, honey. Miss you too, Love Jones. Thank you, honey. Yes, the spirit has been good to me, honey. Some of my blessings I've been able to show and discuss publicly. And most of them I have to keep quiet. And you know, that's hard for me, honey. Cause you know, bitch like me, we like to talk. You know, we like to talk about everything, girl. We like to show off everything too. But, uh, you know, you gotta keep some things for the future, right? And I also believe that spirit bless you with things not to brag all the time or not to even show it off, but to help people in that process. How you guys? Woo! Yes, honey. Yes. So yeah, it's Sunny Mr. Too. I'm glad you found my channel. Love Jones. Again, you know the other one, honey. You know they got a little jealous, honey. You know how you know how you know how they get, honey. You know, black people can never build up securities within themselves and uh try to yeah, girl, it is what it is. Yeah, honey. Ain't nobody gonna be You're gonna start messing up, y'all. I'm looking for the, I'm looking for the Asian food and the uh the oh here we go. Oh yeah. Hey boy. Yes, honey. Come on, honey. Come on, love Jones. Here we gotta get us some cajeta. Yes, caramel sauce. We're doing some tea, honey. We're good. we put together a love jar, honey. We're gonna put some guava in it right here. You see this right here? Peach for my bottoms. You see that right there? You got the 
you got the you got the booty and you got the pit which is a you know what that is that's the colon honey then you got the the guava for the woman honey you see that right there? what are you doing we won't go on to that <laughs> we'll do a class on that honey how you doing they don't got no whole peppers y'all damn y'all they don't got no whole peppers Oh my god, I guess I gotta go look for someone else. Cause these they they want five dollars for them, girl. Girl, but I could go to my organic store and get an ounce of them for a dollar thirty-six. Some told me to get them while I was there yesterday. I don't know why I didn't. Come on, Keith that man. Hello, Grand Madam. Yes, honey. It's gonna be cycling y'all. If it cuts out again, I'm just gonna if it cuts out again, y'all, I'm just gonna see y'all later. <laughs> Then I'll see y'all later. Come on, Kid Devin, how you doing? Yes, long time no talk, girl. Hope it's hope Europe is, is treating you well. Is Europe treating you well, girl? Yes. Europe, Europe better be treating you well out there, honey. That's so I'm gonna come over there and show them what it's like to be an American. No way. <laughs> You know what? I'm gonna have to go to. I'm gonna have to go to Winco because they don't sell cinnamon sticks. But they want five dollars. Walmart, what's going on? Is everybody buying cinnamon sticks now? Oh, cause the holiday is coming up. Uh oh, they think they slick. Girl, they think they slick, honey. I'm gonna have to go to Winco. They got them like this. They said nine dollars for this girl. This would be two dollars at, at Winco. They tried the fuck out of that. Anyway, yes, honey, five dollars for cinnamon. Yes, Grandma. Let me show you. These are the ones that I normally get. <clears throat> they want four thirty-eight, Grandma. You're not around to put in there. dollar. Let me see. Is it right here? Grandma, let me show you, honey. I may have to go to food for less, honey. Look at this, great madam. Four thirty-eight. Put this right here. And it's like, damn, we understand. You know what I mean? We understand what, it, what we understand. What we understand. But it's like, how much? This is two ounces for five dollars, and I go to my place and get two ounces for two dollars. I'm gonna get it because I'm already here. I'm gonna get it because I'm already here, honey. Oh, look, girl, they got drinks from uh, India. Is that India? Yes, honey, Malta, Malta, India, honey. They also got Mont Brevis from Goya, honey. Come on, girl. Look at that mango, y'all. Mm, 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 mm. And the alcohol, cocoa. Yes, honey. <clears throat> Isn't that crazy, girl, madam? Yes. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> yes. Yes, honey. Y'all. I can't believe that's all they got as far as cinnamon goes. What a sunny one here. I'm going to let y'all go because I need to open up my little goodie book to see what else I need. I need to get, I need to get a new wig, too. Don't y'all, don't you remind me, honey. I know I need to get a new wig. Don't you remind me, girl. Mind your business. Don't, you know, don't, don't, don't you remind me about that, y'all. Tell me what it is. Don't tell me what it is, honey. Don't you tell me what it is. I need both hands. Woo! Girl, it's hot up in here. Yes, come on. Hello, Larry. Yes, how you doing? Oh, y'all, this is good right here. Hawaiian sweet Maui onions. Girl, good. Good, 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 honey. Let's see who up in here. Let's see if we can see Toucan Sam up in here. There go Toucan Sam right there. Look at him right there, y'all. Y'all see, see Mr. Leo over here? Watch this bullshit right here. Look at him. Look at, look at this motherfucker. Y'all see him? Look at that 
there. Um, mm -hmm. What else? Let's see. I think I got everybody's comments, honey. The, ca the coyotes be wilding inside of your dorm? What? The coyotes be inside of your dorm? Jay, honey, you must be in, near the mountains. You must be like near the mountains, honey. You and, you and uh, San Gabriel, San Gabriel, honey. San Dimas, you over there? They got coyotes wild up over there, honey. I had a friend that lives in some apartments over there in San Gabriel, honey. Those, those animals are wild over there. Let me sit here and gain my, let me gain my composure. Woo! Come on, Larry. You would see your brother today. Awesome. He moved near you, Larry? Yes, honey. I'm good, honey. It's hot as hell, though, Larry. I think it said it's 97 degrees today. It is hot. Allergies are, are starting up, too. So I woke up today, honey. It was like, I could fill into my sinus, honey. A whole bunch of mucus tea. I said, girl, let me get my, oh, maybe I should give me some allergy medicine while I'm here. So I don't got to pop out and do it later. Because I'm going to say, bitch, what the hell is going on? Yeah, it's a time difference. I know, Key Detman. Key Detman, what, 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 uh, what time is it? Uh-huh, 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 yeah, uh-huh. Yeah, uh-huh, uh-huh, yeah, 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 uh-huh, yeah. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> it's 12.50 in the morning? Damn, it's only uh, it's only about to be five o'clock here. Damn, Key Demi, that's, that's late, honey, huh? I guess I gotta do my lives early in the morning, huh, like 7 a.m. Yo, this Walmart is big. Listen, I could lose my way if I walked around this Walmart all day. If I came here and walked for two hours, I was on my way. Look how far that aisle is back there, y'all. Can y'all see how big this Walmart is? Let me just show y'all around. This is the Walmart I, I used to come to all the time. Look how big that Walmart is, y'all. That's garden way down there. That's groceries way down there. Let's 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 go to the side. D look how look. those motherfuckers look like ants back there. It's big over here, y'all. Tell me, y'all. I put my shades back on, bitch. People are looking like they know me, girl. They might know me. Let me put my shades on before they try to bomb rush me, honey. <clears throat> they might try to bomb brush uh, 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 sis, honey. Put those shades back on. How you doing? Oh, look at this queen. Hi, honey. Look at this queen right here. Yes. Yes, honey. Yes, honey. Queen it out. Work it out, honey. You know, I love to see my, my brothers over here, my butch queens. I love to see my butch queens strutting down the aisles of Walmart. I'm not the only queen that likes to shop at Walmart. Anyway. <laughs> yes, kids in Europe. Yes, honey. It's officially Sunday. Oh, it's yeah, it's still Saturday over here, honey. But you know, Sunday is when the sun come up over here. Mm-hmm. He's in prison. Today was his visitation day. Ooh, there, I heard the hell about that. I heard the hell about that, Larry. Remember, when my brother was in prison. I didn't ever see him. You know why, Larry? He lived. At, he was in the mountains over here, Larry. In, in 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 California, they will put your ass as far away as they can from your family. My brother was in uh, Susan Susanville. Yeah, I think Susanville. That's near Reno. Honey, I was not going up there. When he got released, they went and got. They went and got him. I didn't visit up there, girl. Which place? Uh -uh. So is it flattering? He's in the Everglades Correctional. Come on, Larry. I might need to hire him when he come out. When he coming out, Larry? I might need to hire him, honey. He may be. I might need to hire him, honey. Get outside, London. Yes. It's rainy over there. Shit, we need some rain. Grandma, we need some rain over here, honey. It's hard to tell. My back is sweating right now. My thighs are sweating now. My back is sweating, honey. I might need to go get me a, I didn't bring, I don't think I brought an extra pair of panties today. I might need to go buy me, I might need to go buy me a pack of panties and I suck so I can change my panties, honey. I don't deal, I don't do wet panties. Yeah, I mean, you know what I mean. Oh yeah, she said you want to go eat. Yeah, let me call her. Let me call her. Didn't I just say, girl, we want to go eat? Let me call her. Let me call her right now. 
Yeah, let me give her a cool eye. Yeah, let me give her a ring. He's a redhead too. Ooh. Is he into the girls, Larry? Larry, is he into those special type of girls? Hello. So girl, I'm, do, I'm doing my old change though. My car won't be available until 545, girl. Okay. So you can walk around with me today. So come on up here, girl. I'm already in Walmart right now. You can come up and walk. I'm in Lodi. <laughs> Wait a minute, why are you talking like that? <laughs> girl, the spirits of Queens is jumping on you, girl. You be <laughs> The Queen spirit is jumping on you, girl. What the hell is going on with you? Okay, okay. So you got DID, bitch. Let me get about this damn phone. <laughs> girl, this bitch said she got multiple personalities, girl. Listen, let me keep my distance from your ass, bitch. No wonder why I be feeling some, some energy. Thank you so much. No wonder why I be sitting here, girl, and I be feeling that energy come on in. I feel a personality come on in and, and start swirling around and looping around, bitch, because it's your demonic ass. Bitch, come on over here so I can do some holy prayer for you, girl. I got some, I got some Florida water. Let me come on. Bitch, fuck you, bitch. Ain't nobody got a bitch. First of all, I'm a Gemini. How you doing? Bitch, your mama. How about that? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Your mama, bitch. Your mama. How about that? Your mama. I can't believe that, girl. So you said I got multiple personalities, too. Can you name the personalities that I have? Hold on. What is it? I'm bitch and that bitch. It's called transgender bitch and that bitch. I'm the crazy bitch, bitch and that bitch. <laughs> Girl, those are not called personalities. Those are called moods, honey. Put me in that. What mood do you want me to give you today? Okay, okay, you met. I was gonna say, bitch, those are called moods, girl. You put me in that bitchy mood, bitch, I'll give it back to you. Oh, look at this. What is going on here today? Ow. Ow. Anyway, we're holding down a corner of the devil's triangle. Come on. You got you about to put a dress on? Yeah. I heard that. So where you at now? You at home? Okay, girl. I'm I'm girl, I'm just gonna sit here and talk to YouTube girl until until they die out. How about that? When the phone dies and I'll say I gotta go. You're not putting no draws on. Bitch, it's too hot for that. <laughs> bitch, you, <laughs> bitch, you better spray some filter down there, honey. Cause I, <laughs> I do not want to be smelling no damn fish. What, what is going on here? Did y'all see that down there? Girl, there is a theater going on inside Walmart, honey. They, they, they some actors and actresses today. Girl, she's over here doing something. I don't know what that is. I don't know if that's a transgendered, if that's a man or if that's a woman, I don't know. But, um, yeah, I'm be here, girl, doing my YouTube, girl. What you doing today? Okay, that's why you're acting like this. Uh-huh. Oh, you haven't had to be in a long time? No. Yeah. Look at that, y'all. What is that? What is that? An oh, he's a Satanist. I love it, honey. Girl, I'm here. I'm here at Walmart. Girl, this guy had a, have a, a thorns, a crown of thorn thing on his on his calf, honey. And the the guy did, at Winco, why you didn't tell me that he had an op tattooed on him? That white guy. Yeah, that was a white guy there at Denny's, honey, last night, and he had a he had an op tattooed on him. It was like a rosary type. I want to say, honey, are you a part of the Eckhart stuff or are you a part of the Rosicrucian tea? What is it? Then, then you know what he did? He put on these glasses to try to play off like he had a different identity. He brought that. I said, honey, yeah, I hired you as a spy. Do I got what? No. Oh, probably my car, yeah. Mm. 
Well, listen, you can always use it and put it back. Girl, ain't nothing wrong with that, girl. It's a wig anyway. You can't get lice. You can't get lice in a wig, honey. You you can't you can't get lice in you can't get lice in a wig. I know that's right. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> y'all missed it. Y'all missed it. What is it? Uh, okay, your scalp is dry, but your hair is moist. Your scalp is moist, your hair is dry. That's called sweating. Listen, girl, I'm gonna, listen, girl, I'm gonna swap. Uh-huh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You want, you want some of that, honey? Yeah. Girl, I'm sitting in front of the candy, because they all looking like I'm weird to sit in front of this candy. Bitch, y'all want some? Y'all want a Snickers? Bitch, I'm right here buy Snickers, honey. Y'all want some fi some fiery uh, Snickers, girl? Oh, girl, they got Snickers with, with, with chili pepper inside of it. Girl, why didn't y'all tell me that? Girl, let me get this for my spirits, honey. Hold on. Bitch, they got Snickers with chili in it, y'all. You know, girl, call me when you when you almost here. Bye. Do y'all see that? They got Snickers, y'all, with, with chili peppers in it, girl. Chocolate with chili peppers? Bitch. We giving that up to somebody, honey. Oh, Snickers with chili, you had it? See, I like, I like hot Cheetos with Snickers, so now I can have some Snickers and, and chili peppers. Who you doing? You calling out AMR? See, come on, Grand Madam. Listen, listen, Grand Madam. Honey, that man was a spy at Denny's. Grand Madam, this man was like a bodybuilder looking like, no, just normal looking. And the girl was like, uh, they were like a banana milkshake, blah, 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 blah. And uh, he's like, okay, one moment. And then he, you know, goes to the back and comes back, y'all. He have on these thick old bifocal glasses. And I'm like, something is weird about that man. And I was telling my other friend, I was like, yeah, something's weird about that, about this guy right here. And then sure enough, I see his forearm, because, you know, he's like making it obvious, you know. Is this arm right here? He doing this and shit, you know. Get him to the house. Get him to the, to the thing. And guess what? He got the damn untattooed on him. And I'm like, what the fuck is going on here? You want, you want, to, you want to date a black woman? What, you know, he have that onk on him. Ain't nothing wrong with that, but you gonna get some of that? You want some of this, honey? You know? <laughs> <clears throat> and he had like dirty blonde hair. It was like a tricky hair color. It was like brown. It was like light brown with highlights of blonde in it. And I noticed his real hair color because his beard had it too. And I was like, that is some weird shit, honey. And people talk about aliens. That's aliens, honey. I don't care what nobody say. Uh, if you look at a motherfucker and something look weird about them, like I've seen black people too. And I'm like, something is weird about that person. Like their skin has like weirdest tints to it and shit and then the hair you're looking at the hair like there's something ain't right with that something is off you know what i mean the skin looks crazy it looks like it's a dead body like i'm not even lying either some people look like they have dead bodies embalmed walking around with an embalmed body i'm not even joking girl <clears throat> and you see it with, with everybody hispanics too girl you see me you're looking like that bitch look a little odd that skin looks sandy a sandy color, sandy copper. There's something wrong with that. Come on, Rose. Let me take a picture next time I see it. I'll show y'all. <clears throat> hurricane flow is tossing water. That's right. That's how y'all got that rain. We need that rain too. We need a hurricane over here to give us some rain. Is the spirits gonna ever give California a hurricane? Give us a good old hurricane, girl. I will take that energy and, and, and use that shit. They be like, Hurricane Anna's coming to California. Yes! Bitch, everybody be like, what the fuck's wrong with this bitch, girl? We gonna use that energy, bitch. We gonna use that energy. That is geomagnetic energy, girl. We gonna suck that energy out. Put that fork out there, bitch. Put that metal out there on that damn ground. Let the energy swoop on by. Cause she ain't gonna rip that shit up out that ground. She ain't gonna rip that shit out that ground. Anna, Flo, they, Flo uh, Florence. Shout out to my friend, her mama's name is Florence. Shout out to Florence, honey. It's hot, ooh, Florida's like that though. Florida's hot and cold on and off, honey. When I was there, <clears throat> the clouds came in so quickly. I was there November 2014, I wanna say. 13, November 2013. Yeah, November 2013. Damn, it's been five years. 
wish I could have left her. It's been five years, guys. February the 19th is my is my five year anniversary for my boobs, y'all. I'm gonna do a party. Can I get a boob cake? We'll all slice that boob cake open, y'all. Celebrate. Ow! Anyway, so yeah, when I went out there, it was hot. And then all of a sudden, it was like a little breezy. And then it started getting cloudy. Bitch, I said, bitch, I'm in a twilight zone. I'm in a fucking twilight zone. This shit was crazy. We can have a crazy weather too. And the funny part about it is, the storm comes right after the five <laughs> The storm come out five, come on. Come on, honey. Hey, listen, I need to make my way out there to St. Petersburg. Uh, Norma, when I'm when I'm out there in St. Petersburg, I'm gonna hit you up, girl. I want I need to, there's something out there in St. Petersburg that someone told me about that's kind of hidden. I said, I wanna go out there. My friend was like, we should go out there. She wants to drive from uh, Texas into what is it, Pensacola and Wilton Beach, Clearwater. I said, girl, but I think I wanna go now because they said they have, uh, there's something out there in St. Petersburg, something spiritual hidden, hidden in plain sight. We need to go out there. I also wanna go out there to Arkansas. They got that Baphomet uh, statue out there. Shout out to Baphomets out there, the, the Baphometes and the Baphometians out there. Shout out to the Baphometians and the, bom the Baphometesis. What are you doing? You're a Baphometesis. Uh, go ahead and, and, and type one if you're a Baphometesis, honey. Make your account uh, anonymous. What are you doing? We gotta get out there to Arkansas, the state of Ra, and uh, see the Baphomet statue. What are you doing? Red hot chili chocolate. Come on, Grand Madam. You gotta put some teas up in your honey. Okay, Grand Madam. Yes, you've been feeling you on the Celtic Hedge Ritual with some shamanism at the moment. Come on, Key Deadman. Hey, what happened to DW? DW, girl, I'm gonna have to look her up because she actually hit me up on one of my sites. I have to hit her up, honey. DW, girl, I remember DW was on camera. She was throwing up her herbs in that room. Y'all remember that spiritual room? She had her gerber burner on. She was making that oil. I said, come on, DW. She was utilizing that energy, girl. Did you know when the power come together, girl, that shit shifts through. Mm, something needs to shift through to that too right there, honey. Let's see. Ooh, ooh, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Mm, he was red hair too, y'all see that? He was, a, he was more of a ginger. He was more of a ginger color, reddish brown. You know, I'll take that too. You know what I mean? I'll take that cheat right there, right there, right there. You said it right there, I'll take that right there. I'll take that, 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 that. I'll wait on my friend, I'm on YouTube. <laughs> I'm like, what are you doing here? <laughs> I'm, I'm just looking today. I'm like, people, different people come in the daytime, huh? And I'm like, oh, she's recording. Like, she's not recording nothing. It's just she's chatting. Yes! Like, yes! Yes! I know, you know, some place they'll be like, no filming. It's like, I'm on my phone, but I guess security reasons yeah you know you could yeah. be like here's the prize uh-huh uh-huh yep yep yes, yes. Like, yes. Don't want no she's like what is she recording i said she's not recording anything <laughs> it does look like her because i'm doing this and stuff hot <laughs> i'm right here for the back uh probably. they got you doing schedule today mm -hmm. okay girl i see you double looking okay uh-huh, uh-huh. <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> Entirely too much sun going on. Uh-huh, uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> she was like, what am I double looking at? I see you double looking at that red head girl. Ooh, ooh girl, you coming back. You coming this way. Ooh. Ooh. Yes, honey. Mm, 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 mm. He looked like a bubba. <laughs> I know, look. I'm definitely get some of that. Chili pepper infused with a snicker. I eat hot cheetos with, with uh, chocolate. It tastes so good. So I'm like, I wonder what this is gonna taste like. I don't know. Probably burn me up, huh? Probably. Give me that. Okay, <laughs> Right, right. And I was like, I'm gonna take a little, a little uh, nibble and see what that does. If it does something, I'll eat something. If not, uh, -uh. <laughs> nope. 
And it's only three dollars. I mean, that's that. Yeah, only three dollars. How did you how did you like that when I went to the club? Literally a time. Yeah, it wasn't yeah. boring. Is it bigger? No. Okay, see. Um, so. Yeah. It was still pretty small, but it wasn't too bad. Yeah, but really? Were they smoking in there? No. Okay. I, mean, I don't know if they were or not. Okay. I didn't really notice it. Okay. Because when we went in the smell, I was like, yeah, I'm not coming back here. Outside. Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, Halloween. Yeah, it's been too hot. Day time. Why? It's the middle of summer. Isn't that crazy? It's yeah, yeah isn't that weird? And they said September 3rd, you know. Why? Because I need to finish my office. Okay. <laughs> That's what they get, little apples. <laughs> It was hella rude. She said she's going to Alexa. Aww. Aww. Y'all see the little dog. Baby, baby got him a girlfriend. Look at her. Look at her. She's scared though. She's scared. She has social anxiety. They need to get her something. She's walking with her tail down. Dogs don't walk like that. She's scared. You have a good day. You too. My friend seen you and I. Yes. I said, yeah, only after she was married, I was talking about you. Yeah, she's hot. Yeah, I'm going to get the hell out of here because he's tall. She'll beat me to death. <laughs> You're married, are you? I am. Oh, wow. Well. Yes. Have a good day. I Wendy a little bit. Yeah, they, they all said I love her. Hot. I love her. I love Wendy. Hey, hey take it. You too. Remember one thing. Uh huh. You go to the crab beat. Uh huh. Where? It, it, it'll be at, the, it, it's usually at the uh, fairgrounds. To the, uh, here, Lodi? No, in Stockton, okay, uh -huh. in the ghetto. Uh, okay. Make sure when you go, uh -huh. uh, you look for me. I'll, uh -huh. I'll, it'll be in January, okay. and Daniel, and, 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 and he's really cool. Okay, so crab years feet, junior what? Years ago, no, years yeah. ago, uh -huh. to Terry Euler's dead, and my best friend was Tessa's the one who died in uh -huh. Auckland. Uh -huh. You know, yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's when I found out, he laid down his life. The yeah. Mongol got, four years later, got a year and a half. But. What I'm going to get back to is this. He took, Terry Euler was in for like 30 years, and he goes, Terry, you, you need some black. And he goes, yeah, I, I, I had it once in prison. Oh. But it was punishment. We're, 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 we're up at Black Bar. We're up uh -huh. in San Andreas, and we're all hot. And he acts, we're all doing coke. And he actually admitted that. that I, wow. But that was funny. That was funnier shit. But what, I want, what I'm telling you is uh -huh. this. Okay. If you ever want to go to a good bar uh -huh. in Stockton, uh -huh. do you know, do you know uh, Thornton Road? Yes. Go to the Captain's Anchor. Tell yep. AJ you know me. Okay. The dude always came in with a Viking sword and an eight-foot bike. Okay. And I ran over it. Dano used to leave his bike at my house a couple times. He, he left it there while I went to Sacramento. Wait, where's that at? You said Thornton what? Thornton, it's it's right where... Uh, Near remember, you know, where What's the best? Dante's is the best pizza. Okay, yeah. Okay, okay, and then and the, the and then you got what? It's... Remember this, I don't go to bars. Like one time it, yeah. I did for Oscar, he, yeah. on, he was on 7th Street, on Charter Way, I did a bunch of walls. Uh -huh. And I pulled up on my bike, I had a green bike with Sarah. And I hated her, me and my friend always talked about because I had uh -huh. jet bikes, they never break down. Uh -huh. Why do you have a primary chain? I'm not even going, but right. guess what? I pulled up there in Lodi, and there's three dudes, and the one dude was buff. I had a few minutes to make a decision, and I never got a tattoo. I worked on that, that thing for a week, and the, the little guy for, the, the, that ran a tattoo parlor came over, spun the guy around because I knew I was probably going to lose. Wow. And, and I was so happy about that. But what I want to tell you is my friend, Dana, was in the club. Uh -huh. I thought he was pretty because he's talking about rolling logs on the ends. Next year, he said, I'm going to fire him. Die for Blackie. <laughs> oh, die for him. And he's the best one. He'd go 40 miles, a 30 pound backpack. And that motherfucker, I seen him knock out. He's tough. And he wow. went through the fucking Hells Angels in eight months. And Fest, you know why he was cussing him out? I was doing Fest's back door, putting a four foot door, cut out the block, and I made a jam. He said, You motherfucker, I don't give a fuck about stealing the bike. He said, You son of a bitch. You had 105 violations. You went down in, in the schoolyard because of the helicopter. You know how much I, you would have hurt me? You would have died, you bastard. I love you. Wow. And that's what your real friends is. Remember one thing about me and my real friends. Uh -huh. And I want to hang out with a few people. Yeah. If they don't want to die for you, fuck off. Right. That's right. And, you know what? Yeah. and we knew I, I became, 
and forget you ever talked to me because a lot of people hate it. <laughs> you know, it's like when your friend Steve runs Sunny Bar at your shop, <laughs> and, the, and the dude runs San Francisco Papa's your, and every, everywhere you go, and people want to beat the fuck up because you're an asshole. You know when I went to Branson, Missouri? Guess what? what? They had a special meeting for me. I got to get out of here a little bit because my friend, but, what, but I'm going to tell you something. When we got back, you know what? Because I worked all over the United States. One recession and I took, but I did stores. Uh -huh. Like one time, me and my friends went to Four Corners. Just me and Jeff, and when Jeff started, uh -huh. yeah, 11 DUIs in 85. He couldn't get 11 another DUIs. one. 11 DUIs? Yeah. Oh my God, that's a lot. And, and, and his other buddy, you know what? My, my, where I kept my bike for years? You know, you can't testify. Uh -huh. George got drugged by a handicap man. And Oscar, the guy who did the tattoo far forward, his uh -huh. son got on TV because he got hit first. He got kicked out. And that guy never got prosecuted because wow. nobody will testify. In Missouri? No, no. He okay, coming here. back from Oakland. Okay, okay. Yeah, he got, George got his hands and feet drug off. What I'm telling you is, Ooh. guess what? Mm -hmm. Who runs that thing, uh -huh. Thursdays to Saturday night, when you want to go over there, uh -huh. it, it starts at 6. Okay. AJ's his name. Okay. And he's really cool. He's got a couple. Okay. I've known him for years. Okay. And, and you don't have to worry about any fights ever. Okay. You know, I come out of the bathroom or whatever. I see, he pops somebody, he takes him outside. I go, hey, man, it's all... You having a good night? And you're like, mm. I say, you still got your teeth. Uh-huh. Because most bars, like I said, you know that day I was talking about the pub? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. guess what uh -huh. could have happened okay. with that guy? Uh-huh. Okay, that dude had like 23 inch arms. It only takes like 10 seconds and you can get your teeth knocked out. Oh, God. And, and remember something right now, I'm mm -hmm. telling you. Mm -hmm. and when you go to AJ, just tell him you met me. I had a stretch bike, okay. Dyna bike. Okay. And, 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 and he'll know what I'm talking about. Okay. And I always had that Viking sword. They put it behind that thing. I'd go, I had a Harley, but I'd ride over. I, it was only two blocks, and I'd take my dogs. One time, all these girls came over and talked to Bailey. And then the, these girls were gay, walked over. And I usually keep, never kept my mouth shut. And I did, and I forgot where she lived in my neighborhood. But the shoot she said, you can get any girls in here with that dog. But AJ, you'll like him. Okay. He's cool. Okay. And you know what? What I'm trying to tell you uh -huh. is, go to the crab team. Okay. My, my friend Dano has still been there okay. all this time. Okay. He does stamp concrete, and you don't have to worry about shit. Okay. And if I see you, okay. if I mean, you know, yeah. you can hang. Yeah, you and your I, husband. I don't, I don't know. care. I don't but know. You know, know what? That's crazy. Well, see, it, it'll be in January because okay. that's the time of the year, and it should be at the fairground. Okay. It might be somewhere else. Just look up Nomads for the crab feet. Okay. Anyway, I, I, I'm planning on going this year. Last year, I didn't make it because I was some. Well, what happened is, is I couldn't get a bus, and the girl wanted to take me. Everybody was pissed off. They were looking for me. Wow. Oh yeah, they waited for me forever. It was somewhere else. I think it was. Uh, it was at a different place too. But anyway, <laughs> find it and have. Anyway, yeah. my friend, what I'm trying to tell you is he's cool. Okay, okay. They're cool. Okay. And you know, when I worked at, I used to go to the adult bookstore in town. Mm -hmm. There was a black guy there, and he told me the same thing. Right. He knew three or four Hells Angels. They were cool. They're not prejudiced. Okay. And remember one thing above Coeur d'Alene? Uh-huh. All half the people up there are white. Okay. You know what? <laughs> On TV, Channel 6, the white people are telling all those skinheads to go fuck themselves because they're fat hassling with white and put yeah. the different people at yeah. Burger King. And I'm going to tell you something about the United States. Remember one thing, half the United States uh -huh. contractor's license are 25 bucks. It was in the 90s. Idaho, Minnesota's that way. And guess what it is for 2,400 square feet above Coeur d'Alene? My friend got his permit in 99 for there on 20 acres, 500 bucks. Wow. So think about it. You cross over the Rockies, you're screwed. But look at the wall. The weather is not is twice as nice as Tahoe when it's 18 degrees. If it isn't windy, you're sweating because it's dry. <laughs> okay. So Spokane and all that area is nice. Okay. But what I'm telling you is there's a lot of different things. Okay. But this is what I want to tell you. Look this up. Okay. And remember now, I'll give you one thing about a Christian. My mom prayed for me. That's what got me out of trouble. Uh -huh. About 72, Dima Shakira and Catherine Coomer, downtown Oakland, and a rainbow running around the building. You could see it from the Bay Bridge. And they flew over it. Now, I didn't think about shit until 10 years later. My friend had a blue out picture. You couldn't believe that. Wow. 150 Christians prayed. And it was a hot summer day. And it was like 100 yards wide, wow. 40 feet away from that. But when I seen the pictures from this the camera, but what I want to tell you is this. Yeah. God loves you. You yeah. never back down. That's true. He only bragged about one dude yeah. when he walked up. Uh -huh. Venturian. Uh -huh. So I hear my hurt. He's healed. Uh -huh. My servant's healed. Uh -huh. Or whatever. And he walked up. You know who that dude was? He ran a hundred Roman soldiers. He killed people for a living. He was a badass boo. Wow. It's the only person God ever bragged about. And he, remember one thing, he whipped them out of the devil. Yeah. He flipped over those things. That's why they paid for Barabbas. He died for us. And the reason that asshole went to $30 of steel, he thought 
he wasn't being a rebellion. No, he came to die for us, yeah. not to rebel against and take over Rome. Mm -hmm. He loves you. Yeah. You know, and you don't want Jesus to do Yeah. Because you're stupid. Because <laughs> remember, there's 47 I beams in those uh -huh. buildings that went down. And everything's about us burning. Yeah. And what is the Antichrist? When he comes, Daniel, remember, talk about the first part of the, uh -huh. where we're at? Uh huh. Well, guess what? Alex, remember, he was the baddest dude. They got thrown in the fire. They didn't even smell like smoke when they came out. Nebuchadnezzar's kingdom got scraped off the face of the earth by Alexander the Great. You know why? Because he went to that island. That guy had the biggest navy in the world. Okay. Now where we're at is what? Mm -hmm. We're at the end. Mm -hmm. And all Babylon, every, the whole world mourn. Why? Because we got to, I don't know if it'd be New York. Or, right, right, but This right. is the deal. Who is the Antichrist? <clears throat> you will copy Satan. And guess what? Who, Who came first? John the Baptist, the false prophet, comes, uh -huh, uh -huh. He calls fire. Then, who's the Antichrist? You know the ten nations that everybody hates Israel is around them? Uh -huh. The Antichrist comes with a bow and with no arrows. He's just a peacemaker. Uh, and and, 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 and remember Donald one Trump? thing, 10%, I hate Trump. I, yeah, I you think he's nuts off. <laughs> I'd like to shove him up. I hate him the first time I see you him. You think he's an Antichrist? I hate, no, no okay. he's just a piece he's of shit. Nice. Okay. He's just a candy ass <laughs> punk. <laughs> and I've only been in a few fights my whole life and that's for bullies. Uh-huh, yeah. You know, when you're dyslexic and you're crying because everybody's laughing at you because yeah. you can't read mm -hmm. in grammar school, you, you, what you do changes. And I used to go backpacking in the wilderness areas, never used to have me. Where anybody be at mm -hmm. during season, deer season, two or three weeks by myself. You know why? why? Is, to, is to get my, change you, mm. change you. But my mom always prayed for me. And I had fish and had bears 10 feet from me flipping grubs and I didn't die and I should have. Wow. And I can tell you a lot of things, but what I'm trying to tell you is, hey, God loves you. Yes. And I'm messing with you because you're beautiful. Thank and you. And you're putting up with my ass. And that's really great. <laughs> yeah. But the main thing is, hey, you'd be surprised what can happen to you. Yeah, yeah. And my mom, she died because my three uncles went insane and called themselves God. Oh. And my grandmother went in the hospital. And when she changed, she changed. Mm. That's what got me through life. Yeah. All the shit. Because I've never been all that great. Yeah. You know what happened to me? What happened? Both my parents were dead. Uh huh. And a dude who was a billionaire, he helped all kinds of people in town, but nobody ever knew him. My dad told me about it. Uh -huh. They were moving stuff from the one car garage to the two car garage that day. It took him a year to move in his house. And he had a house of 7,000 square feet. He never turned on the heating air, one foot thick walls. And Lynn Garner hit a chicken when he came to this state. <laughs> and he, he treated every plant. And I, just before my dad died, he told me when he was in the home, he did for hundreds of women. Wow. Now, all kinds of, they got beat up by contractors and he'd take them like five grand and leave it at them. And nobody ever knew. Lynn Garner and him told me, you know that day that he gave me this cabinet and I'm over there, he said, Dave, can you go to Oakland and pick up this, my, 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 my thing. He had lived in Oakland Hills. He came down here and hung out with my parents. When they go down south, guess what? He would, my parents would hang out. He'd hang out with them in their trailer when he had a $400,000 wow. home. But remember, money don't mean shit. People like Trump are evil. Lynn Garner, nobody ever knew about it. My dad told me all this. He was the one that took money to different people. Well, guess what? The day that he gave me that the cabinet, and I took it, I couldn't go get a rock cutting machine because my truck wasn't big enough at this plant in Oakland. He had a heat treat at one time, like 80 people. He treated all the turbine blades for like 747. That's what I remember. And that day, my dad, they're moving everything into the one car garage and, and, and putting everything and putting the Cadillac in that. He lived in Sunway. Half a million he just put in his backyard on. You know what? That day my dad moved. A half a million what? It just in, in landscaping. Okay, okay. My dad moved 10 bars at 12, two inches wide by a foot, a half inch thick. He said, Bob, you know, and they were in the garage all the time. You see, you know what those are, Bob? They feel like lead. Platinum. And you know what? He was cool. He always made me laugh. And, he, and then I found out how many people. He helped hundreds of people. Mm. But he never let anybody know because he wasn't a fix. Right. And, and Trump is a piece of shit. Yeah, uh-huh, yeah. So think about it. Yeah. Think about it. There are a lot of people, and, and God can do anything want. But remember, I went to Branson, Missouri. It sucked. We, guys were getting married. 500 Hells Angels have to get go some, meet in the Midwest. I didn't go the next year to Missoula, Montana. You know that town's like the 60s? There's no child molesters. And you go, hey, well, I want to go get a beer. Guess what? The guy would go, where are the keys? Well, the truck's stupid. I want to lose it. And in that town, you know what happened? What happened? And those 500 L's things were there. Uh -huh. Seven, six of my friends were there, and the bars got let out. 
the out of town cops with full riot gear, just a few of them, not with riot gear, we're gonna arrest one guy for a DUI. You know what they told them, the people in the bars? They told them, you can take your out of town cop shit, don't <laughs> fuck with these, because they're not gangbangers, and take your DUI and shove it up your fucking ass. Wow. And you know what happened? In that paper, every week I met a guy six years old. I knew about it. Mm -hmm. My friends said they never seen it. My friend Fess and those guys, they were watching. They said they never seen anybody dudes fight like they fought whole life. They said they were like goddamn Vikings. And they got it on against full riot cops, shield, uh, shield, fucking helmets, billy clubs, and got it on. And you know what? It lasted over one fucking hour. And you know what else? They voted out the sheriff next year. And when I heard about this, I met a guy who was coming around the club six years later and it was in the paper every week for six years so look that motherfucker yeah think about it people not everywhere are what you think and not right. is what you think right right yeah and people like trump need to die yeah yeah because you know what love is what life's about yeah. and this is the thing with the hell's angels a lot of people i see get you, you know what it's all about is it being a person your work yeah 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 that's true right, and after yeah you, and your, if you want to have a good life find the people that will die for you. Those are the people you run with. Remember, 10% are Christians. That's my dad used to say <laughs> in churches. The rest of them, and that's, yeah. he only likes certain people. Yeah. He had to respect all those. Yeah. But the reason he changed? Yeah. You know why? Why? One time I told him, I don't know if I can tell him, but my mom's a Christian, he says, I don't pick you down like a damn stepchild. You know what? <laughs> and the first time I met him, we were talking about, we became really good friends because I did what I said. I pumped up my bike with wood. Uh, I put $2,000 front end, I don't have Seriani front end, a cartridge, and this shit. But that was it. And I know how to write. But I always did what I said. Hey, but this is the deal is when he died, think of it. Yeah. We were coming back from Los Angeles, and he was scolding Gabe. We were, he was a prospect. He said, Gabe, you screwed my wife's best friend. And you know. Wow. She, she was married to a biker. Mm -hmm. And you know what? You're going to meet him in North Carolina. Mm -hmm. And if he puts a bull in your head, I'll be helping him bury you. Wow. And I screwed the Hells Angels by, but I didn't know it. I had dealt with it. Wow. And you know what? He was telling the truth. And when we went deer hunting, two years, he didn't want me to join anymore. He said, I had more fun with you and Steve. I'm not going to tell you about how tough Steve was. Because he had four karate his He's the baddest night fighter. A lot of cops hit him in the road. But he was funny and shit. And we went all over the world, different places, each year, creeping and stuff. And I'm gonna tell you something. My friend, dad was a professor. His son's a lawyer, and he knew every answer on Jeopardy. And when he was dating his wife in Laughlin, they wouldn't let him wear his passion. He went there for a reason. I'm gonna say what? And you know what? When that guy got out the gun, when the riot started, they started fighting. The guy got out the gun. He told him all to get down. Hit the guy. I, I think in the head. I, I could have looked at the video, but he laid his life down. And then when 30 Hells Angels came in, they started shooting. And Diego, he's going like this. The guy from Alaska, this kid. I knew. He got his finger shot off by Diego because he's real rich. He had like three bars, but you know, you don't know who there's. A, Michael Hearn is about this big, and, and he stayed at my house, <laughs> and so did Buzz. And Buzz was no smaller. Did two tours of game. And 30 years ago, when he's a bar hopper, I, met, I knew a kid that said, "Yeah, you must know some bar hopper." This guy Buzz he beat up like 10 people in a bar. So size don't mean shit. Yeah. But what I'm trying to tell you is, is this is what my friend, why I love him so. That's when I found out. Because he, my dad loved him because one day I was doing an asshole and after my dad left without two hearts and that fucking shit was going on. And he said, oh, fuck shit. You better go home and apologize to your dad right now, you bastard. And I did. And I found out, you think about it. My friend had died before I met everybody. That time when I told him about, I don't know if I can join this club, he said, you think I'm a Satan voice, you fucking asshole? So remember, you never know who's who. Mm -hmm. Think about that dude, yeah. the, the Romans. That, that dude wasn't no soldier. Right. He ran. You know how badass you have to be to run a hundred Roman soldiers? He ran mm -hmm. Israel, that where Jesus died. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And that's the only person he ever bragged about. The child unless you remember. Yeah. Get the biggest rock you can pick up, put a rope around it, Jesus said, because they didn't want the little ones to come in. They knew who God was. Mm -hmm. All little kids came around. They said, take yourself out in the ocean and throw yourself in mm -hmm. with that rope hooked around and that rock. My sister said child molesters can go to heaven. I don't know. I think it's like Trump getting to the eye of a needle. You know, a donkey <laughs> ass bastard. <laughs> what made your sister say that? I don't know. She's a nice person. Oh, okay. okay. You know, she's a better, you know. Yeah. She even yeah. voted for Trump. Yeah. My oldest sister was married to a doctor and she, she you know, my, yeah. Yeah. I, they're the Republicans. They're idiots. Yeah. They look at it like uh, money. You know what? I Obama was the better. If it wasn't for him, 
I wouldn't have half the benefit. Right. He's the only one who's ever done anything. And he's so nice. Yeah. And on TV the other day, he makes Trump. He's such an asshole. Yeah. He put more people around just trying to show that there was more people there that day. There wasn't shit there when he got <laughs> nominated. Everybody hates his guts. Right. I yeah. hate him the first time I seen him on TV when he was doing his thing. Really? I've only been at one fight. Me and my friend never got in fights. You sit. We would do Viking drugs and everything, get drunk for two hours, and then eat, and our girls would get us right home on Friday night. That's the only time we party. The only thought I got in, I went down the street, and you know what? A lady moved out, her glass lawn was this high, and I went back and got in a fight with a guy, just came the seats off his lawn, and threw him in his face, and fought him, and I did a big line, and two bottles of wine, and he couldn't mock me out. I, I tapped him a couple times, and that's the only reason I got in a fight, was because they weren't cutting their lawns and our houses were worth half. And I made the payments. I was making $40 an hour building custom housing at Foothills. I'm not just an average carpenter. Right. But I'm going to tell you something. Guess what? I found out after that. And I got out of it, you know, because I told the DA I was, at the, I was at the asparagus festival. And he bought it, but the deal is <laughs> all those houses, everybody hated them across the street. The four that were there, and the lady moved out her aunt, and nobody mowed it, it was three feet high, and I was dead. They're all around us. And now everybody started moving their lawn. But I was pissed. I mean, my house was, you know, we had uh, houses that were 3,500 square feet that were over a half a million that were worth 150. Ours were worth shit. It was 1,500. And, and you're letting your lawns go to seed? Wow. You know what I mean? Hey, how are you? You can't even sell your house as it is. No. And now you don't even want to fuck. And their lawns were this high seat, so I skinned them off and I threw them in his face. I said, what are you, in a candy ass? You're going to hit me or not? <laughs> he fought me a couple times, so I was laughing at him. I said, that's all you fucking got. <laughs> but you know what? I don't want to ever get in a fight. Me and my family always talk about it. If we ever see somebody hit a woman, we'll probably go to prison. We'll probably kill him. And remember one thing. Tell your husband not to get involved in shit. Uh-huh. My friend Tim Priest's son, uh -huh. he's as big as me, in front of Lodi, right in front of the post office, two weeks ago on a Friday night at 9 o'clock. There's a black lady getting beat up. And he didn't even see the guy. I don't know if it was black or white. He got in his leg, but went in this wide, went in four inches, and he screwed up. He went back to work, but he was moving to Pixie Woods, and his legs all black and blue. So that's what's chicken shit. It yeah. happens so quick. Yeah, the good but, Samaritan stuff. He can't yeah, be that Yeah, you try to do the yeah. right thing. I was just talking so about he, that. Yeah, like so, we you did know, that. So, you know, if you're a husband, man, you better have a gun. Watch his back. Yeah, yeah. Because you know what? I think anybody that ever hits a woman, he is fucking. Punk. Yeah, he's, you know he's like no better than a child. That small dick motherfucker needs to kill himself. Yeah. You know what? If you don't want to work it, then fucking cut it off. Right, <laughs> right. you too. Take it easy. Yeah, fun and life. Yeah. Just remember before you know it. Yeah. It is yeah. You know what? Yeah. I've seen hundreds of miracles. Uh huh. Because I went to Calvin School and when I was in fourth grade, there was a she invited all these pastors from that. I didn't believe in the Philly. I'm a student. And she never fucking begged for money. You sat with the Philharmonic. They got up on both sides, 150 people. And all they wanted to do was talk. And she raised her hand. They all went down. And they're flopping on top of one another. Wow. And they're all start shooting. Shoot. They went down, flop. A lot of them jumped right back up. But they all went down. And she didn't touch one. Wow. And you know that asshole that got healed that with Arab or something? He's always pushing him down. Went to her meetings. He's a piece of shit. He's really, that's what I don't like. Yeah. She never pushed him. Yeah. If they, she just barely touched him. Like, yeah. yeah. But that guy's an asshole. You know what? You know why people get healed at a lot of these meetings? Because when you got ten thousand people that are believing, yeah. the faith heals. The energy. Yeah. 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 And you the can energy. feel it. Yep. I remember one thing. Colonel Robert Rogers got tortured for six and a half years, and then they shack him to a concrete bench. Right? for two and a half weeks. And he prayed in tongues for a half hour and that supercharger came on and in the corner of the room, he saw a cloud. And after that, they released him for a year and a half so he could come out not weighing 65 pounds. But remember this, when you walked into the temple, you had a ruby this big, diamonds around you, a million dollars in jewels. You know what it matter? You looked at you that road, between that thing was that cloud. When you walked in there, guess what? On the bottom of your road was bells and there's a rope tied to your foot. And if you weren't right, they drove your dead ass. <laughs> People like late Grant Pryor, the Hal Anzi piece of shit. Guess what? After after we burn, nothing happens. Everybody goes back to normal because guess what? He comes, he's a peacemaker. Right. So no but no nuclear war. Yeah. Three and a half years. You know what happens? Yeah. Out on the temple. Yeah. Then hell comes in. You know what the Valley of Arvin is? And you know how Lindsay was saying there's vultures gathering here? Pat Robinson the same week saying there's none there. He was there. Guess what? 
That's when they flee Israel. They come to the Valley of Armageddon. Before their bodies hit the ground, the flesh is burnt out of their skulls and they put sticks by their bodies six, seven months later. Wow. Now think about it. Why don't you want to be here? Because during that time, when the bulls are let out, divide the world into three pies, one turns blood. And guess what? That's when Satan's released, right? And everybody's yeah. moving. Yeah. You can't go outside because there's no sun. The sky is black. And guess what? If your arm gets out, it says if you're, you have to cover your head. If your arm or any of your skin, your skin will burn. Would well, you want to be? And you know what God says now? At that time, if you didn't speed up time at the end of the three and a half years. And look this one up. Seven black women were in what? They were in a bathroom. It's mm -hmm. called Live to Tell. In 92, where that black president went down and they issued machetes. I don't care, it was black on black, different tribes, and they kill a million of them. And I seen her on PBS and she came to Stockton. Read it. She talks about all the miracles. She's like Anne Frank. Mm -hmm. And you know what? I was crying. And she mm -hmm. said, hey, I still believe in human beings do it. But that was called Live to Tell. Here, you know about that? No. 99, yeah. The president went down in Africa. He died. And they issued machetes. And they came to that preacher's house three times looking for those women. They, he had a walled in a bathroom for six months, walled on. Wow. Six or seven women, I can't remember. Anyway, I just read some of them. But I, the front and back, where I watched it on PBS for an hour. Wow. Well, you can see them. Mm. But, and, and, so, if you don't think that Hitler, you don't see what I'm saying? 47 I beans, remember? Mm -hmm. Three months later, that why are we going to burn? Right. We blame it on them. Yeah. And, and, and guess what? They shot down, what, 20 planes out that ocean? Yeah. And they couldn't find the, the landing gear in that field? Yeah. Hey, and what, they sold so many trillion dollars that week? You look it's at, a oh, setup. You know what? Have a good life. You, yeah. And you're hot and shit, and I got to tell her. Thank you. Right, girlfriend. Thank you. Yeah, I look at... Uh, 17 winter car, uh, I decide uh, mine. Uh-huh. And if you have a girlfriend, uh -huh. you guys come on over and I'll take me to Captain's Anchor, I'll be the free booth. Okay. Yeah. You, you know, I'm here. Yeah, okay. I'm like real, but you know what? I haven't had a girlfriend for a while, I don't care. Yeah. You know what? I'm gonna edit. Right. <laughs> Bye. Bye. That's interesting, honey. I hope y'all didn't get that address. I'm gonna have to delete this video because I don't want nothing to happen to that man putting his information out there like that. Who does that? 627 uh, wind cir wind cir Windmill Circle. Bitch, y'all know about windmill. It's gated over there. Oh, well, y'all can't get in there anyway. It's gated. Ha! <laughs> Never mind. Y'all got the address. Oh, there's a purple balloon right here, y'all. This little girl have a little purple balloon. That is so cute, girl. Did y'all see the motherfuckers going by? It, girl, it was the land of the redheads today. Did y'all see all those redhead motherfuckers coming in here like that? About 15 miles from her. No, she fly on out. Oh, hell. Hell to the no, no, no. What the fuck is going on over here, girl? Just when the day was going good and you felt the spirit of God moving on in here, girl. Raggly Ann and Bubble Shrimp done dropped and pulled their whole damn tribe in here. What the fuck is going on over here, girl? I don't know if that's a head wrap on her or if that's some, some fucked up ass weave over there. What is, girl? I need some magnifying glasses, girl. What can I... We're gonna get some magnifying glasses. I need to go ahead and get some out of there. But anyway, y'all see all those fine redhead motherfuckers walking by, by me? Mm. Yeah, somebody had a hurricane coming last week. I, oh, I want California one, not Hawaii. Hawaii is way far from California. Hawaii is about a six hour trip from California. It's not that close. Hawaii from here is like from here to the East Coast. Remember when I choose your grandfather's be there? That's my surgery anniversary. Come on, Larry. It's my aunt. Yeah. I want to see that. I'm drawn to Scotland, England. Ireland scares me. I get to the British Isles, but not this week. Listen, I want to go to, I want to, go to Ireland, honey. That's my ancestry, honey. Irish. Irish blood, honey. I got a lot of clients out there, too. Can we go? Oh, that's an auburn color. Oh, brownish red is an auburn. Okay. Listen, you, you saw them great madam. I need me a ginger. Let me start asking people. You got a ginger brother? You got a brother that's ginger? Huh? You got a ginger brother that want to get down? Honey, want to get some fun? <laughs> Redheads got a lot of fun, honey. They're always hot. 
They remind me of fire. Give me that red head, honey. Let me, let me ask people. You got a red head, brother? I know no, she don't. Let me ask her right here. Let me ask you got a red head, brother? She was like, not for no nigga, bitch. <laughs> But y'all won't have to put no chocolate in the body in the store today, y'all. I don't wanna have to open up no m and y'all and, and, and slap somebody's grandma with a zip and them. Bitch, what you think? <laughs> it's not stressful, come on. Yeah, you take your time, go ahead, honey. Stop it, stop it, grandma. Yes, outside London, so it's more live. Yes, honey, sign an autograph for your fans. Come on, come on, Larry. Carol Smith Rail, come on, honey. Yes. I'll mess you so we can hook up. Yes, honey. I'm always get people stopping to tell me crazy stories. Love Jones, okay, honey. He went from trying to get it to the Bible, to his Hell's Angel friends, to EVC people. They don't know about Hell Angels, y'all. You know, I I see. I, don't, I think there's some nice ones because when that transgender out there in Hayward, California, was beaten to death October 21st, 2001, Gwen Arajo, uh, the Hell's Angel people actually came through and they actually, um, what do you call it? Escorted. Can we talk about it? Escorted her body to the cemetery. So I can't say that they all like that. You know what I mean? I can't say that. Just like not all Christians are godly. Okay, can we talk about it? Just like not all Satanists are ungodly. Because I will tell you this, more there's Satanists have done more for this world than Christians have. And that's sad to say that, you know, I'm non-denominational, but I'm just telling you how it is. You know, I've seen people on the road croaking over and a Christian person said, I'm not going to say that person. If it was ain't nothing godly about them, it's time for them to go. You know, look at the West Mar look at the Westboro Baptist Church over there in uh, Wichita, Kansas. You know, these are Christian people talking about some, you got a place in hell. But then you have the Satanists, honey, who see an old lady croaked over and they go over and rescue the lady. Tell you, don't listen to what they say. You're set correct. You are set correct. <laughs> Listen, Grandma, he seemed crazy, but he wasn't crazy. He seemed crazy, but he was not crazy. That man is definitely giving out. Grandma, I would have got down and gave him some of that, Grandma. Grandma, I would have got down and gave him some of that, honey. Don't you stop me, honey. Grandma, don't you stop me if I, I would have stopped down and, 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 and arched it on over and said, follow me into the tea. You got some coin today. I need my oil change done. Please that. You know, because I'm a sex worker. I was going to pull out my tricks that I have, honey. I was going to be like my sister that came down here from Detroit. She was pulling. She was, girl, I'm right here. Girl, you call to see where I'm at. Girl, I'm right here in the entrance. You come on in, girl. I'm standing right here in the center. You will, you will miss my big ass. I'm, I'm wearing all black today, girl. Today, you going to call me. Not the Cookie Monster. Today, I'm more of, um, I'm more of uh, a big ass black crow. <clears throat> You're not even here yet and you're trying to call me, but you're not here. Hello? Bitch, I'm hanging up. Bitch, we're not playing today on my phone. Dear honey, oh, what's going on? Okay, Baron's kid, honey. The guy from Alaska, he was rich. Come on. Okay, he's going to drop. Come on. Come on, Baron. He, honey, he was wishing, honey. He was wishing, honey. And that's, ain't nothing wrong with that. You can wish upon a star. You wish upon a star. You can wish. Don't mean you ever gonna get it. You know what I mean? But I think he got my old change coin. That's $50, honey. If I'm, if I'm not worth 50, bitch, you ain't never gonna get a woman. You don't get $50 for so a lady, you ain't never gonna get a woman. Why do you think these girls be offering $40 specials and stuff, honey? You know what I mean? The girls be offering forty dollars specials to clients like that. You know, they see that client right there. They be trying to offer forty dollars specials because they can say, "Well, bitch, if you don't got forty dollars, he ain't got shit." But I'm like, girl, you gotta put some value on your tea, girl. You know, the man that I marry, he got honey. He, he, girl, he better really be ready because I'm paying for shit. You gonna you gonna hire me, honey? I'm gonna be a mail order bride. Anybody out there in the United? Um, uh, Saudi Arabia, Latin America, honey, call me, honey. I'll be a mail order right. You need that green card, don't worry, don't worry about it. You'll get it le the legitimate way. Get over here, get a, get a visa, honey. We go through artificial insemination. We let them know that I have been pregnant by you 
and they have to let you in. Bitch, please, they can't find that shit. Girl, bye. Everything switched over, girl, legally. Girl, bye. Been that way for 10 years, girl. They got to do some digging, okay? And uh, we get you that green heart, bitch. You come on over and we do our thing. Because if you get pregnant by it, listen, no, let me stop. Let me stop before they try to get me. I'm not going to that. <clears throat> Teach you how to get a foreign man, a man that want to work. Because you're not hate a lazy man. You're not going to stand that. And you better get a job. You better work. You better work. You better provide. You know, let me do all the light shit while you do the heavy shit, bitch. Let me do the, the shopping. I'll go, bitch, please, I'll go shopping. I'll go get your clothes. I'll go get your drawers, your shoes. Bitch, please, you don't got to do shit. Just go to work, come home, and go to bed. And give me what else I need, honey. You know what else I need, girl? I'm a dickaholic. <laughs> oh, you heard it right the first time. Dickaholic. Dickaholic. Dickaholic, girl. This is, uh... D D. This is uh 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 this is D A A. Dickaholic Anonymous. Hi, my name is Mrs. Persia Fallon Ferrari Mia Morena Exclusive Mia Mortis and it's go by many names. And okay, come on, Grand Madam. He sounds like his horses. I know, listen, Rose, he got a gun. He got a shotgun. He said me and your friend your friend uh, he got a shotgun, honey. Uh -huh. Most of them do up here. This is country living, honey. They got guns everywhere, honey. You, bitch, please. Girl, bye. Honey, when I have clients out in this region, I tell them, meet me outside. Come outside, bruh. We're not getting out the vehicle. We're not walking to no doors, bitch. Honey, no tea, no shade. They're not getting me today. Ooh, y'all see that radio back there? There's a radio coming up. Mm-hmm. I don't know they have so many redheads up here. I'm gonna have to put an ad up up here, y'all. Let me post the ad up tonight, y'all. I need to put an ad up and say, any redheads, please give me a call. That's all I'm interested in at this point. If you're not redhead, please don't even look at me. I'm not paying attention. If you're not red, don't call me. I want my man to be called Big Red. Redheads, whether you're white, black, Hispanic, everybody get redhead, girl. They got Asians that are redhead, too. I've seen Asian redheads, I've seen Hispanic redheads, I've seen black redheads, I got a few cousins that are redhead. And I've also seen white redheads, I got a few cousins that are redhead too that are white. So, you know, you redhead, I want my man to be called Mr. Big Red. Big Red Gum. Ow! You know what I mean? Ow! When they be like, yo man, I pull out that Big Red Gum and say, I won't say this though. Well, it could be that. You could work that too. And then run with that girl. Bitch, please, you can work anything. You can work anything, honey. If you're a real woman, you can work anything. Who you doing? He just kept talking. Come on, Jer come on, Larry. Shit, he was excited though, Larry. He, Larry, he thought he was gonna get this too. Talk about some. Are you married? Yes, I am. Bitch, please. You look like you will enslave my ass. Like, come on, baby. He'll whine and die you for five weeks. I seen that TV show called Snapped, and the ID channel Fatal Attraction, bitch. Get me on in that house, honey. After five months, bitch, and you own me. Get me to sign my life away. Become my power returning bitch and speak for me, bitch, please. That's the only thing you ladies need to be doing. You know, no, no, I'm thinking about that. No, I'm thinking about that. That's what you ladies need to be doing out there. This is what you ladies be doing. This is what y'all need to start doing. Become a power returning for your husband. You know, if he doesn't sign over his rights to you, bitch, you need to let it go. Look at this bitch right here. You came out through the side door. You didn't see the sign in there? Yeah, I've been grabbing what's under here the whole time. Right here. The whole time. L listen. Girl, you didn't see me. You didn't, you didn't see a tall guy talking shit? Oh, because you went that way. You came in and went, you went that way, and then you came around like that. Bitch place. They almost done, too. They're going to be calling me. Huh? Girl, you don't know this number. Nope, call it. You don't got it, because every time I'm always dead, so I never get this number out. Girl, if I get a phone call for this number, I know something is right. I know something ain't right. Jesus. Oh, my God. Oh, oh my. Woo. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Polynesian, honey. I, I, need me, I, need me, I, need me, I need me some I need me some Polynesian tonight, too, girl. Girl, listen, you don't got to have it. That means it's all on the front. I think I dropped 
the Snickers with a pepper daddy. Can you go ahead and reach in there and pull that on out for me? Excuse me. <laughs> Hold on, let me end this with them. I thought that was my TV on the sports channel. <laughs> girl, this guy was talking, girl. It was like a sportscaster. Girl, no, they can't see, girl. Let me, let me go ahead and walk and let me end it with them, honey. Let me go ahead and walk and I'm going to end it with them, honey. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay. So listen, everybody. Uh, uh, finally got a stopping point I'm about to purchase. Come on, fairy. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Purchase, Mina. I'm sitting right here waiting for you, girl. Yeah. Oh, in the name of the... He looks like Binky. Yeah. Yeah, in the face. No, 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 no. Binky or or Orlin. Orlin. Binky Orkin. Bitch, where you get that top at? Let me, let me, let me borrow that. Yes. Bitch, let me borrow the bitch. You look like a forest tree and shit, bitch. She wearing green and brown. Honey, what's going on today? She thinks... Anyway, y'all, let me go. Hello, Tasha. Listen, uh, she said bye, Tasha. I don't know which personality we get today. We don't know if this is Kiki. We don't know if this is Katima. We don't know if this is. Uh, we don't know if this is. Mer is that? Oh. She got a little baby on her shoulder. Anubis is mean, y'all. I just realized I got a mean dog, y'all. Anubis will not let me come in this store and without him barking at people. Huh? But see how the dog wasn't barking? It wasn't barking though. Baby would have been like, wah, 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 wah. yeah, he would have tried to get out my damn hand, girl. And then when I held him, he would have tried to bite my hand. Like, bitch, you better let me out. Anyway, y'all, let me go, y'all. He's gonna sign you up with the hell's like, come on, that's right, honey. That's right, y'all. Listen, y'all, I may come back. I don't know, but I have to go. Did y'all see this right here? Did y'all see this right here? Did y'all see this right here? Huh? Tell him to get a life. Anyway, y'all, I gotta go. Love and light. Peace and blessings. And uh, I'll see. Uh, honey, she's over here rocking a purple. She's matching, though. The hair purple goes to brown, brown goes to green. She, she's feeling Jamaican or something, y'all. Girl, let me see you do that little dance, girl. Let me see you do it, do it, do it. Do it, girl. Ah, she don't want to do it, honey. She's scared, y'all. She's scared. Anyway, I will see y'all next time, girl. Sorry about that long, long video of that long conversation with that guy talking like that. But I couldn't help that, y'all. He came up, he approached, and I couldn't be rude and say, Yes, you can. Bye, 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 damn, bye. You don't see me on the phone? Bye. He was an older man, though. Yeah. He was like 45. He used to have better than no better. Well, I would think he saw because I had him like in the chocolate like that. Okay, he was that you're doing that? Girl. You know, this is that. This is Maybe I was talking to myself. Because you know, they always say that. I'm on the phone and I'll be like, I thought you were talking to yourself. Oh, well, mind your right, right. Mind your business. You went outside about what I'm doing, bitch. Mind your business. <laughs> she was redhead. Okay, let's say. Let me go, y'all. Yeah, Sunny. Big red gum. Come on, Rose. Anyway, I see y'all later. Okay, love and light, Grand Madam Honey. Listen, y'all. I may come back later. Depends on my energy. If not later, maybe tomorrow. I got a little surprise for y'all. Maybe tomorrow. Ooh, he red here too. Damn. Bye. Yeah. Bye, y'all. I gotta go, y'all. I'm starting to get. I'm starting to get hot up in here, y'all. I need. I need a. I need some pills up in here to calm me on down. Do they got an anti-horny pill? What do they call that pill? Oh. 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 I gotta go, y'all. <laughs> Bye, y'all. Bye, y'all. Love and light. True spirit and mystic eight. Two eight spirit eight mystic eight. Blogspot.com. Two eight spirit and mystic eight at gmail.com. Bye for now, y'all.